guys so as you can see I bought another fish tank and the reason why is because this desk was originally my dad's desk and he had three computer monitors so that's why you see like that big strips of plugs back there and <laughs> hi you guys um so when he finally removed the computers I just had this huge space so I was like why not get another fish tank so I just went ahead and bought it without even telling my parents because I mean by this time I'm pretty sure they know that I want to turn my room into an aquarium so I just went ahead and bought it um, and it was really hard carrying it because I went there by myself and I'm like 90 pounds it was just really hard carrying the tank and then the hood and then all the other things so yeah it was hard but it was worth it because I got this tank for you guys since I'm not going to be using the 20 tall fish tank I'm actually going to use this as an outgrowth tank for my baby betas so I actually bought some things for the new fish tank the first thing I got was the Aquion deluxe full hood and I went ahead with the full hood instead of the glass lids because I always have bad luck with those glass ones because I always keep dropping them went to the safe route and I just bought the hood instead Next, we have the Alquion 50 watt heater, and this was from eBay and since it was like $5 cheaper. And then I got the Eco Completed Planted Aquarium Substrate online as well. And then these three items I bought at Petco. So, the first thing I bought was the Omega One Veggie Mini Pellets because I will be getting a cherry shrimp soon, and I thought this would be perfect for them. I also have some neon tetras right now, so this will be a perfect protein food for them since their mouths are so tiny so this is how they look like they're super super small and then this i actually never seen before but it is the api safe and easy and it can clean inside and outside of your aquarium which is pretty awesome um it doesn't really say like the ingredients that are in the solution but the benefits it says cuts through white crusty mineral deposits safe for fish and plants for use on both glass and acrylic aquariums so I mean this isn't really necessary because you can always use a wet rag and just clean your aquarium but I thought I would just give this a try because I just waste all my money on fish supplies and lastly I got the background because you obviously have to have a background in order to see your fish better but I'll be using the black side because I do that for all my fish tanks I will also be doing a separate video on how I set up this fish tank when I get my new filter in the mail so stay tuned for that so please give this video a thumbs up if you guys are excited for the new community fish tank and don't forget to hit that subscribe button so you wouldn't have to miss any of my exciting videos thanks for watching bye guys also you can now add me on snapchat and instagram both of the username is youtube underscore jenny and i'll also leave it in the description box below